Yo what's up guys, this is Alias and in this video I will show you how to make this really cool looking holographic sphere or world effect in After Effects and it's super simple, we just need one or two tricks but no plugins or whatsoever so yeah let's go. So let's just make this invisible and let's add a new solid. And first of all we need to search for the grid effect here under generate in the effects tab and just apply it to our solid and yeah we don't need to change that much of the settings here but what's more important is to search for the sphere effect so just type in sphere and make sure to select the CC sphere effect and then just apply it on this one and yeah as you can see this looks already kind of cool but we wanted to move and be a little bit more animated, so let's do this real quick. So let's go to the beginning and just place a keyframe at the anchor and the corner. And then go to the end. And we can just go in here, make sure to click it. And just um, type something like plus 500 in here. And this is really important press OK and you also can do this on the lower effect so also press plus 500 and with this tool it will um, yeah it, it will just be steady there won't be if we, if we didn't animate one of these or put in different values it will look weird so make sure they both go to the side by the same value like for 500 or 1000 if you want it to be faster but yeah, this does this cool thing. And yeah, let's also add some some nice effects like a glow effect, for example. Just put it on this one. And we have to change the settings a bit. So first of all, let's increase the radius to like 100 maybe. Or even 200. And yeah, you can just play with this a bit. Maybe like this. I think this looks cool. And we can also add a tritone effect. And just make this white as well. And this will just, so yeah, just leave this everything as it is, but change the midtones to white. And this just makes everything a bit stronger. And maybe we can yeah, actually put the glow above the tritone effect. And yeah, let's maybe turn the, the glow down a bit and the radius up again. But this is up to you. You can yeah, do whatever you like. And in the tritone effect, you can also yeah, give it some, some nice color. If you change everything to the yeah, color that you want, like this and this. But let's leave it white for this example. And yeah, this is it basically. But you can of course play around with some of these settings so maybe we want it to be a little bit thicker so put in 10 or maybe thinner put in 2 for example so this is completely up to you but that's it basically and you can also if you want the circle or the sphere to be bigger play with the sphere settings so you can just yeah make it really big like this i think this looks good and yeah, now we got this cool effect and...